Hi, I'm AJ Fry. I host a TV show in Canada called Inner Space. My job includes both conducting interviews with guests and talking with my co-hosts about all the news and happenings in the world of geeky fandom. So my job is basically talking to people, both the ones that I'm actually with and the audience on the other side of the camera, all while trying to make it look natural. So I think about communication a lot. It's what I do and it's what I have been doing for the past almost seven years on space and two years before that on YTV. You can talk with me on Twitter. My handle is at AJ Fry and because of my job, I've got 8,000 followers. I read all of the tweets that come in to me and I will try to reply when I've got something to say because that's how I do conversation in real life too, you know, when the cameras aren't rolling. But if I don't have something to say or something to add, then I don't say anything. I just keep my mouth shut like most people. How often are you talking with a friend and they'll say something that you agree with, but you don't feel the need to say, yes, I agree. You just kind of nod because you don't have anything to say. Sadly, unlike real conversation, there is no nod on Twitter. The only way to acknowledge that you've read a tweet is to either reply or hit the favorite button. And I must admit, I favorite a lot of tweets. Maybe too much. That's the point of this video. I know there are some people out there who actively hate when their tweets are favorited. They think of it as a non-acknowledgement. I myself don't see it that way, but maybe I'm in the minority. So I want to know what you think. When you tweet at someone and all they do is favorite your tweet, are you bothered that they didn't take the time to give you an actual written reply? Does the person that you've tweeted at actually make a difference in your level of offense? Should Twitter maybe just add an acknowledge feature so you don't have to favorite things that maybe you're not comfortable favoriting? Like some people will sometimes give me constructive criticism, which I appreciate, but it also feels weird to favorite constructive criticism. Anyway, let me know what you think on the subject. I'm at AJ Fry. Thank you for watching.